Between two clouds, there is an interval. And that interval is the blue sky. Slow down the thoughts and look into the intervals. Look into the intervals and pay more attention to the interval than the cloud. The first thought has left. The other is not arisen. That is freedom. That is consciousness. That is your own place. Your own abode. You are always there, you see. That's all the teaching is. Always look to consciousness. Always look to consciousness and know this awareness is what you are. This is your own place, your own abode. Stay here. No one can touch you. Who can enter here where you are? Even your mind cannot enter. This awareness has no name. And when you try to give it a name, the trouble arises. You are nameless and formless. You can't see anything. Just know I am nameless and formless. And that I am aware of my own self.
the pure consciousness will pull you back. It is not that you will enter into it. When you enter into it, it is ego entering. But when it pulls you, it has made the choice to take you home. This happens somehow, and we can't know why. Very rare beings are picked up by consciousness. Once drawn in, your travels are over. The mind cannot go to touch it or to reach it and it will miss it if it tries to find it. These attempts are movements hiding the stillness. Check all the movements of mind for one moment only. Stop all desires and all thought for one second only. especially the first thought of I, for one instant only. And you are beyond the cycle of birth and death. This cycle is samsara your own imagination. Thought obscures and will never reveal that. So don't think. Peace is beyond thought and effort. This is why keeping quiet is the key to the storehouse of love and peace.
Identify yourself as this quietness. As this nothingness. And be careful not to make it an experience. Because this is mind tricking you out of it with the trap of duality. The trap of witness and witnessed. Being is being. There is no witness and no witnessed. After letting go of object, do not hold on to the subject either. Let go. This moment is the screen on which all is projected. It is always still and untouched. And it is out of time. There is no difference between the ultimate and this presence. To be this moment, abandon all desires, including the desire to be in it. Before the beginning, you are pure consciousness. You are the fullness of love in love. And the emptiness of awareness.